all right here we are again now caffeinated let's uh let's get this started so we just came off of a mom run pretty bad run all things considered uh we have isaac done with mom so let's uh do somebody we don't have let's uh, let's switch it up let's do an eden run see what we start with um we are a vampire yeah, Charm of the Vampire and the Mistake Eraser, aka the Glowing Hourglass. That's good. Oh man, but our stats are bad. Oh, smokes. We got some pretty bad, very subpar fire rate. We got less than starting speed. We got negative luck. We got bad range. This. And a full health bill. Well, um, this one's gonna be tough. Every shot missed is agonizing. And only two health, so we don't get to make that many mistakes. However, hopefully the glowing hourglass is enough to help us keep a relatively good chance for a deal with the devil. Because if we make silly mistakes, as long as we keep it to once every three rooms, that's, uh, we can correct those. There's a heart. Cool. Oh, took that nice little break to get, uh, caffeinated. Rocking out with some Isaac on a Friday morning. You know, definitely the best part of my weekend is sitting down and then getting hit by some of the easiest enemies in the game. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna redo that room. Um, definitely the best part of my weekend. Getting to sit down and record some content. Just, you know, unwind, relax, and kind of just, just vibe. Some me time. The me time, give or take, 10 people, you know, plus or minus 10 people. Seems to be the running rate at which I get, which, you know, 10 views, not too schnabby. Ludovico technique. Um, sure. I'll take that, I guess. Normally a good item, but, uh... With our stats, I'm not so sure about that but we will see hmm the rate at which we were hitting with it is not very impressive hopefully we get something cool that synergizes well with Ludovico technique because otherwise I mean I guess it's just a straight upgrade because we're not missing as much anymore. I wouldn't say it's good, though. I guess I'd call it like a side grade. I don't know necessarily if it does enough to be considered a strict upgrade, but I think it's I think it's neat. I put Ludovico Technique in the same category that I put Ouroboros Worm, even though that one technically is an upgrade, but at the cost of a pretty big downside. Does the glowing hourglass reset our progress with walnut? I do not know. We will see, I guess. I'll just play ring around the rosy here with Monstro. Now, you know what would be cool? Like, lump of coal with Ludovico. Ludoviki. Ludostinky technique. It's alright, you're done. You're done, just... Consider it over. No more jumping. Ah, uh, this is epic. We want tears up really bad. Tears up and some health. Let's, uh, keep it going. 
hopefully that's going to increase our damage by a lot because right now as it stands ludovico is only hitting like once every blue moon very cool all right and we got our hourglass so again mistakes can be made uh it's unnecessary though because i won't make them actually we don't even need walnut because i'm not going to get hit I almost immediately uh, was wrong. One good thing. What did I just... Why did I do poison damage? Oh, yeah, because I took, took a black tooth. One good thing about Ludovico is I do not have to go next to enemies. I can just, you know, deal with it from across the room. A bomb. This is going to go right here for this tinted rock and probably not reach it. Oh, we got it. Let's go. On to the next room. Yeah, I'm hoping that, you know, just do a... Today I can record a couple of Isaac runs and then just when I'm not feeling like recording anything, I can just throw one of these up here, work on editing it. What a epic chest. Work on editing it. Um, and just have some stuff for the future just so I can That's okay uh, a little more consistently Have things uploaded That's the key here consistently range up literally worthless Nah Nah We'll save our angel chance. I'm not particularly interested in any of that. Pretty easy room. Just stay way over here and deal with all of it. I can kind of hear my keyboard through my headphones and I'm hoping that you guys can't. This is a cool room. Um, but if I go back and it starts to get bad enough, I may have to get myself one of those membrane keyboards. Which, uh, you know, a little bit easier on the ears, even though I like the sound of a mechanical keyboard. There's a sick, uh, just walking into him. Listen, you guys better stop spewing. I won't, won't have this got him uh nope won't take damage not necessary unless that's the other one that just says uh as you kill stuff get more damage in which case i'm a fool and we could go ahead and stop taking it we got the health to take damage but that does not mean that we need to um does this even do anything with ludovico technique i would assume not that is a straight doesn't really matter grade All right, let's keep going seven minutes on to the next floor um what do we get for unlocking mom's heart with eden uh i don't know i guess we'll find out running a little behind no bombs that's sad Link. But yeah, we might just You know, we'll talk about this for the 50th time Because I'm sure nobody's sick of it We, Depending on how we feel We might switch Isaac to one of the series is, is, That is just Not Edited Which would be, you know Talking about continuity's sake would seem out of place with the future uploads but if i edit it a little i'm gonna edit it a lot and if i don't edit it i just throw it up unless you know people would just prefer having the edits i think some of them are good some are pretty solid edits others not so much but it's okay um and then aside from what's in the pipeline, 
I think I'll just I here we'll, we'll keep Isaac pseudo edited all right we'll keep Isaac pseudo edited and then I'll leave other series for no edits so like if I oh that's really good so like if I start playing a story game or something which I should do I should figure out like a nice story game that I can do because that's another thing I could just you know sit down for a session of gaming play it for a couple hours and break it down into a few 15 minute or so 15 minute or so whatchamacallit clips clips videos just so that I can keep throwing stuff up there and maybe if I start uploading things underneath an hour to a half hour maybe uh maybe I can get some some algorithm tread because I know how much they hate extended content believe you me which I guess makes sense they want to promote their shorts so they can compete with uh Instagram and TikTok and you know all the good stuff All right, Gerdeth. My boy. We'll just uh, stay over here. Absolutely uh, killer content. Sick of gameplay. Well, that was easy. Easy squeezy. All right, what we got in here? The holy mantle. Now that is an upgrade. Now that is worthless. But the holy mantle, now that's, now that's good. That's good stuff. Because now we have to get hit twice to get hit once per room. Basically, the rest of this game is going to be a cakewalk. So now I can just focus exclusively on uh, keeping my mouth running. Which I'm sure everyone is excited about. This room also pretty solid for Ludovico technique because once they're down, I can just drop a tear on top of them. Unless I get caught on mushrooms. Actually, I take that back. Having to uh, remote control two characters at once is uh, kind of difficult when things are chasing after you. Two of clubs. For the no bombs we have, that's just uh, two, three bombs right there. All right, uh, no spitting, the no spitting zone. So the Steam Summer Sale's going on, and they've got a little, little adventure mini game where you have to go looking through the store to find games by a guy or games in the collection of a guy named Clorthax. Uh, and they've got it set up to where you cannot search for the games if you know the games, which makes sense. But I spent several hours just scrolling down through games with the price Clorthax. Because that's that's how you tell is that if you hover over it, it's his face. But also the, the price is Clor out of Thax with a discount. And uh, some of them I just cannot find. Simply non-existent scrolling through the genre for hours and it's just not there maybe i'm just unlucky but uh got to about seven step seven last night and it just cannot find one so we might try that again but uh damn my tier is big got bigger is that because of bursting sack that'd be strange a strange interaction all right, you, uh, you stay there. You stay right there, friend. Well, there's our holy mantle. 
Don't run into another shot. That'd be silly. Man, Holy Mantle is so good. Uh, HP up. Cool. Let's go. 13 minutes. Hopefully we're speeding up. Yeah, we're now ahead of the schedule. I don't know when Boss Rush becomes unlocked to the general public being myself, but uh, cool. But maybe if it's there, we can snag a Eden Boss Rush dub. The Empress, nice. All right. Okay, we'll just keep running into it. We'll just catch it. Yeah, no, this is a cool room. I really do like just micromanaging both my position in the screen as well as uh, my tier. This is the one downside about Ludovico technique is that without like homing or something. Okay, well, we'll try this room again. Holy moly. We're just... I'm going to circle around with our tier. I'm having to use 200% of my brain right now. This is so difficult. What a not cool room. And I'm not doing enough damage to just instantly KO enemies. Well, we at least took uh, two damage less than our initial viewing of that room. No keys. I don't even know why I did this room. I don't even have a key for the item room. That's so sad. But we'll keep it going. All right, another jumper. Stop. Oh, that's why we did this room. So we can get a get a key. No, I just smacked my pop filter. Oh, I just smacked it again. Just trying to fix it. All right, what we got here? Uh, the joystick. Three hundred and sixty degree tears with Ludovico technique. Oh, it's also tears up. Okay, well, not all that bad. The tears up part's important. The other part is uh, just literally means nothing. That's okay. Sometimes you just got to get upgrades that mean nothing. Yeah, I've, I've determined. I've determined after uh, thinking it over through the little bit of Isaac I've been playing, I am going to do a New Vegas series. I'll just be nice because New Vegas is just like my pride and joy. I love that game. All I got to do is make sure that I disable the numerous amount of mods I have on there and then in addition I'll uh, see if I can get one of those compatibility packs so that it doesn't crash every five seconds because you know love the game the pieces game runs like shit game runs like garbage I would put a better bet on an amputee with no arms, no legs, and no butthole to run further than you could get base vanilla New Vegas. You just you walk into the strip, crash. Don't walk into the strip, crash. Save the game, crash. Save the game, crash and corrupt the game file. The game got done dirty. Poor time constraints. Now that I'm thinking about it, a tier effect would be really solid. Just like any tier effect. 
Um, don't give me the rotten tomato now that I've said any tier effect. I know beggars can't be choosers, uh, but I'm going to be choosy. I don't want that. I'm glad they didn't hit me because I don't know how to dodge that attack. I'm not even sure if there's a way to dodge it. I think it just goes in some random direction and you gotta hope that you're out of the way. Anything cool? Uh, fuck yes. Give me this. And then I'll take this too. And I'll also take this. Is Azel unlocked? So we've unlocked easy mode. Um, good game. Now if I die, I'm gonna look like a jackass, but that's the uh that's that's the trick. I won't. Yoink. As if the game could get any easier. We just got a giant Xbox 360 red ring of death here. Speaking of Xbox 360, I can't believe how dirty Modern Warfare 2 got done for its remake, where they just did the campaign. Good campaign, yeah. But, I mean, you know, if someone wants to play the campaign, they can, they can just go play the campaign. <laughs> Gonna do a remake. Gotta get the multiplayer in, man. That was like prime 360 day multiplayer. Everybody loved Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer. Now the only place I can really go from a PC's perspective to get similar game experiences is random community servers on TF2. Because man, you go to those community servers, there's some people that are crazy in there. You just, you just walk in, you got like eight people talking in Gilbert Godfrey voices, you got N-words flying everywhere. Mods are coming in trying to contain the situation, but they can't because people just join back and you got one random guy joining in with a VPN, just getting immediately banned. That's uh, it is, is wild. Definitely some nostalgia going into some community servers. Much better than casual as of right now, but that's just because I'm bad. And if I go into casual, I'll get pub stomped. We'll get there though. You know, maybe, maybe at some point we'll see some uh, BSAA Jones montages. Maybe we'll get some first person shooter clips in. It's unnecessary, I know, but you know, I just can't help myself. I gotta take all of these items. Yes, I know that now that I'm going down to the womb, I will just like super die if I get hit more than a few times. But as previously stated, it's just not gonna happen. <clears throat> this is a scary room. Die? Okay. I didn't even wanna go up there. There's too much stuff going on. Bullets flying every which way. Bombs. Yeah. You're not gonna get me this time. Um. Easy. Uh. Easy. hilarious oh and you know what speaking of uh speaking of tf2 now that i bring that up just recently got my first aussie and then i got another one back to back made some uh made some people not very happy my tours uh eight and nine or like seven and eight eight and nine something like that i'm on a good old two shitties aussie sticky bomb launcher aussie minigun both of them pretty pretty solid but seeing as though i've only done a couple tours i just just kind of lucked out some crazy percent to get an aussie like 
point zero four or point four. Definitely not your average drop. But uh, I've been noticing the more that I've played MVM that a lot of people, specifically high toward individuals, they've been exploiting uh, sitting in the spectator spot to try to get free runs in. And they seem to underestimate how petty the average TF2 player is. I was in a lobby that was on wave five of six with somebody coming in just wanting to sit out the last round and join it the last second, or the last two rounds, I guess. And uh, everyone left because you can't kick them. They all just left and they're like, I would rather start an entire another mission than give you the satisfaction of sitting out one round. And I gotta say, I, I you know what? I can dig it. Especially when there is Braze and his uh, guy named five player lobby simulator. Like that's funny, dude. It's real hilarious. You're, you're a funny guy. You love to hear that noise. Everybody just getting obliterated from Ludovico Brimstone. The only downside is that every hit I'd actually take in this scenario is just even worse. Makes me look like a like a fool. Anything cool in here? No. No, not really. Can't be up that way. I was about to just take that room for no reason. Um You're done. You're you're done. You're dead. Let's see. Now who I I still a couple runs out before we have to start worrying about post bombs heart. I think this is four. I don't think we've like lost lost a run yet, and I'm sure at some point we will. But it better not be this run. If I take how many? Seven. If I take eight hits on mom's heart, I uh that'll be the series end right there. There will be no more series because I will have just thrown so hard. Ouch. I just stood there and took that one. Yeah, no, not even not even a chance. Perfection. Thanks for the plus ten luck. We're out of here. What'll we get this time? Let's sip up on some. Good old caffeine. Yo, that's the rope. He's just hanging around. Practicing becoming a shopkeeper. All right, cool. Transcendence has appeared. We got the solar system. Lich baby. Mama's boy. Op. Ace of clubs. Nice, we got Mama's Boy. Not taking any damage. Um, You know what? Fuck it. We ball. We're going to do another one. See you guys in a few.